So you might be in this situation where for some reason your iPhone storage is almost already being removed or there's like, you know, there's already like a lot of storage being taken up, but there's nothing else you can really delete inside of your device for the most part. And this can happen for a couple of different reasons. Maybe your storage is already running out or maybe you're like not having as much storage as you should have, but it's not like you don't have anything else to delete. There's a couple of things that you might want to start off by doing. Number one, you want to make your way over to your settings application right here. You want to scroll down until you find your Safari app settings. So click on apps at the bottom if you're on iOS 18. Scroll down until you find Safari. And what we're going to be doing is basically deleting and removing our Safari cache. So go right here. Go ahead and scroll down until you find the clear history and website data option here. And all you're going to want to do is click on the clear history option. You can also close all tabs, but you probably want to click all history. And what's going to happen here is it's going to allow you to basically remove and delete all that access and excess stuff that you have in the background. So that can be a really big thing that you might want to start doing. Now, another thing that you might want to start doing is to go through and start removing your message history when you're inside of your messages application. So what you can do here is you can go right inside of the apps portion, which is right here, go back into messages, so scroll down until you find that messages option right here. And all you're going to want to do here is you want to go ahead and basically click on the little option that allows you to start deleting your you know, messages automatically. So there should be a little keep messages option. You can delete them after 30 days and that will actually help kind of clean out and remove a lot of stuff in the background as well. So that would be another way to kind of do it, remove and delete all those excess messages you no longer need. You can also click on clear system data. That's another thing you can do. You can also go through and start removing and deleting applications you no longer need. So go right through here, find those particular applications you're no longer using, and you might want to see if within these individual applications, if there are panels to allow you to go and clear out storage in the background. That can be another thing, like if you have some sort of like, you know, clear cache panels inside of the apps, I'd recommend kind of doing that too, because that can also help clearing out some of that storage in the background. So. Those are kind of the main ways to go into it for the most part. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, Solon.